Good morning, it's a bit bloody chilly here on the uh, on Bamra Beach. I am along here with uh, Mr. Paul Thompson and Mr. Alan Lightley. Mr. Paul Thompson you will probably know from he's a fellow YouTube. Alan, you will have seen him in one of my latest videos. So we're down very early, or it has been very early, on Bamra Beach for sunrise. A bit of drama in the clouds and um, yeah, it could be promising. We've got about 10 minutes to sunrise. I've already shot some uh, some blue hourry kind of views of the uh, along the beach to the water castle. A few, few long range shots out to sea. Um, some rain rainstorms on the horizon. So done a bit of that. We'll do a bit more as the sun comes up. See what we get. We'll hopefully cobble something together. Image-wise and video-wise. Right, so what I'm doing here is basically I'm kind of splitting the flip, splitting the frame half and half to half sea, half sky. Um, and basically because there's a lot of drama on the cloud, and then you, you know, darkness just before sunrise. Got some great wave action coming in uh, as tight, you know, the tide's lapping pretty much up your feet. Uh, so that's good. Um, so basically, the image will look like you're almost at sea. Uh, so yeah, um, not best practice because I haven't got the, the, the little tripod on the middle of the lens I've got on the camera, so it is a bit heavy, um, but hopefully that won't make it unsharp, if you know what I mean. Uh, it shouldn't move. I've got, a, I've got a camera on the timer, two second timer, so that should be all right. So, fingers crossed, it works. I've uh, got it already dialed in manually, focus wise. And yeah, uh, let's shoot some more because we've got a lovely glistening light on top of the, on the sea, and then our dark cloud behind. So it's, it's quite nice to have a, an imbalanced shot. It's like top heavy because the cloud's dark and then the ground's light, but generally at sea, the sky's light and the sea's a bit darker. So at this time of the time of the day, it's wonderful. So yeah, uh, doing a bit of that, uh, and then uh, probably moving on to something else. Lovely. As, it, as it's getting light, I've also um, I've just put on the six stop filter, uh, and that's given us a shutter speed of about a second and a half, and that's making quite the difference. It's giving us more motion in the waves as it comes in, and also it's controlling the light a bit better because it is getting brighter and brighter as the, each second goes on. Uh, so, get, so we're getting getting some better results. Um, waves are getting a bit more. Probably a little bit more dramatic as they as they come in closer in. So all going well so far, quite minimal, um, but very like not my not my usual stuff. Uh, but, but quite nice to do something different for a change. Uh, still some lovely uh, rain on the horizon. 
we've got that backlight from, from the, the sun coming up, which is merely moments away. Actually, it's probably already up. It's just hidden behind some low cloud. Uh, but there's some nice, ni nice light hitting these bigger clouds over by the castle as well. So yeah, time to get on with the shooting. Get all going to get the wide angle. A couple of more shots of this rain coming in, and then going to get the wide angle on, and then uh, yeah, see what else we get. Well, I think we are done with the tripod for, for the time being anyway. Might do with some, get the tent stop out and do some long exposures using the rocks along here. For the moment, we are back to handheld shooting, so what I'm really doing here is just aiming right out to see where the lovely light is. There's some there's patches of rain on the horizon, back in, just focusing on them. So, to keep things steady, ramp it up to ISO 500, I think, yeah. F5.6 because it doesn't need to be sharp when it's that far away. Uh, dialing right out to 200mm, I think on the Safi 200. And, and just having a lovely, lovely time. Stay up here and just photograph down to it and then have a view looking out to see towards the far Islands. Uh, and see how that goes. That long, I think I'll, I'm shooting with the six stop on so we get a bit of that movement being captured. So it's all about timing. So, anyways, wish me luck.
think we're about to get some light and here we are it is finally well above the horizon as in yes quite high and it's finally coming out so we're now getting a little bit of light which is lovely for light being cast onto the onto the horizon well not onto the horizon onto the subject so hopefully in a couple of minutes it will strike the castle it's just starting to light the rocks up here in front of us so we're making progress I think finally it's been good it's been good so far it's been good so far very dramatic lovely water uh, and all that so yeah um, let's see what we'll get now do for today's video however it is when thank you very much for watching um, much appreciate your time hope you've enjoyed it hope the pictures have come out well no matter what they are whether they've been uh, tripod based or icm based um, i haven't started any icm yet as i record this so if they came out then great if not then whatever so uh, that will do for today thank you again for watching please do like subscribe if you haven't Follow me on the usual uh, Instagrams, Twitters and all that kind of stuff. And if you're interested, I've got a Discord server to join that as well. Link is in the description below. It's something I'm just trying to build a little bit at the moment. So thank you very much. And until the next one, keep a heart. See ya.